never really looked at things, I think, as other females or you can't. people do. You can't. You learn really young. When you pop out like this, you learn really, really young. I'm gonna have to do me, and and whoever likes it will follow. And I can't look at other people and judge myself compared to them. So, and I think that attracts people. So, I don't, I don't, I can tell you, oh, that looks like the standard. And I know I'm not that. And I know Holly's not that. But we just kind of done our own thing. Um, different is different has been really good for me. It's been really good for you. Yeah. I, mean, I, I, I would not be who I am today if I was not, if I was the average. It's always been an up and down thing. Like I said, I used to weigh 184 kilos. Um, so like 395, close to 400. And um, I got it all the way down to 300 and then it came back up a little bit. And then I went, I was like 350 some when I went on the show and I went down to 250 some and it was the smallest I've ever been in my life. I think the last time I was 250 was when I was like nine. Like I was, I've always been a really big person. I was 300 by the time I was 13. She's got a lot of muscle on her. She's big boned and she's built to basically lift weights. So if you want to call that genetically dis disposed to lift, then yeah, her body is built to actually lift heavy weight, moving a lot of weight in a short amount of time, which is essentially Olympic weightlifting. It's the quick lifts. So yeah, she's basically fit for the sport that she should be in. And people think that I eat whatever I want and I'm, I'm sitting there like lounging on french fries and burgers all day and living the dream, but really, no, if I, if I ate, this is the funny thing, if I ate like Ariel ate, I would be 500 pounds. I really will. I have to watch what I eat to stay this size, otherwise I'm going to be like 600 pounds. So it's, it's just being able to accept whatever you are, where you are at the time. Even if, God forbid, something happened to me and I drop under the 200s, I'm still going to accept myself for who I am because, God, if you don't like you, no one else is going to. No one else has to. I went to the CrossFit once and we went up, <laughs> this guy went up to us and it was actually a great CrossFit, I'm not going to mention the name, but it was really awesome, but the guy comes up to us and he goes, don't worry, we're gender neutral. And we're size we're neutral size here. Neutral. No, and and I've never like... been told that someone's size neutral. I didn't know that was a thing. So I was like, oh, that's great. And so at the end of the clinic, they were like, you know, I think they really like, would you like a shirt? And I was like, sure, I'm a 2X. And she's a 2X and they didn't have any 2X. Yeah. They didn't go over like large. Size neutral. Size neutral. My yeah. Ass, so. Yeah. <laughs> anyway. Anyways. That's just. <laughs> Next on Coffee Talk.